Good evening, everybody, and thank you for joining us tonight. It is a day that we remember and honor all the brave men and women who fought to protect our country. A fallen Hawaii soldier is one of them. Myla Marvelosa died nearly 16 years ago in Iraq. Her belongings recently turned up thousands of miles away, meant to be thrown out. And now the man who found those items wants to send them back to her loved ones. Max Rodriguez has more in a story that's new tonight at 10. It was an unexpected discovery at the Veterans of Foreign Wars post-2591 in Missouri. A bag full of torn and damaged American flags meant for disposal, not so unusual, but included with it an intact flag, dog tag, and a photo of Hawaii Army Reservist Sergeant Myla Maravillosa. They knew that it didn't belong in that bag. It, it, it was still a good flag, folded, intact, and so they separated from all the damaged, torn flags. Retired Sergeant First Class Tim Swartz wanted to learn more about the young woman in the photo. Mirabilosa was Hawaii's first female soldier killed in Iraq. She died Christmas Eve of 2005 when a propelled grenade hit her vehicle. She was 24 years old. It became a mission to say, hey, you know, if, if this was something that the family accidentally got lost in the move or something, that we owed it to, to Myla to make sure that the family was aware of it, that it was found. KHON2 spoke with Maravillosa's mother, Estelita Maravillosa, a day after her death. I miss her everything. Everything I miss her. KHON2 was also there when then-Governor Linda Lingo honored Maravillosa with the Hawaii Medal of Honor. <laughs> she was a young woman of faith. Sword says he connected with the friend of Maravillosa, a sister belonging to the congregation Daughters of St. Paul. Maravillosa volunteered at Pauline's book and media store in Bishop Street. She was trying to find the good in, in a difficult situation. A sister tells me Maravillosa was considering becoming a nun after her military service. A photo in her honor still stands at the bookstore. From this research, wishing I had a chance to meet her. I, she just seemed like such an amazing person. Swartz sent the photo, dog tag, and American flag to a sister and close friend of Maravillosa, who relocated to Boston. They tell me the mother moved to the Philippines, but family members may still be in Hawaii. The battalion Maravillosa belonged to also joined the search, hoping to reunite these items with her family. Max Rodriguez, KHO1 News, working for Hawaii.